Hey guys, so I upgraded to the 3.0 software update. As you can see with the whole user interface and the apps, even the messages, just to prove if none of you believe me, is that I'll be showing you that I do run 3.0 right there. As you can see. Anyways. So, um, first off, I will start off in the Messages app. So, Messages. this They have improved this a lot. Um, I want to start off with the Landscape Keyboard ability. Now you can type in Landscape. Whatever you want. And Ability to Send MMS, which is Multimedia. So you can send photos and videos through text message. Which is awesome. They had a uh, jailbreak app for that, but now it's come with a software update. Calendars have improved. I don't really know much about calendars, and I didn't plan to read up on it much. Um, also, in the uh, camera app, if you go into it, they just changed that. So if you go into here, it shows the last photo you took. So yeah, these are my screenshots, and you can just go back to the camera after that. Okay, now another thing I want to say in the photos, which they improved, and they should have had this a long time ago, is you can email a photo, now you can at least select. I've been sending photos to my email, or to someone else's email one by one, now you can select, and then email, which is way easier. This helps a lot. Next, we have the YouTube login feature, which is pretty nice for YouTubers like me. You can, if you're in the more more tab, you can see at the top left sign in, so you can enter your YouTube password, username, username and password. That's pretty neat. YouTube stays the same. Other other than that, stocks, which is I don't know if it's important. It might be important to some of you guys. But I don't really care about stocks. You can view it in the landscape now. I guess it's a bit better. You can also slide to uh, see all the stocks, how they're doing. Alright, that's a bit improvement in stocks. Um, now we'll go into voice memos. Voice memos is a pretty neat feature just to take quick notes with your voice. Hello, this is a test. Okay, so I stopped it. Almost. Okay. Now I'll go here and you can hear it. You can send them. So you hear that. You can share it with MMS and voice email. Email. Alright. Next thing we have notes. So I'll go into add top right. And I'll just type in something. Um, I'll type in something like this there now you have the ability to shake and then this little box pops up pops up undo typing so you can do that pretty much whatever you're typing which is really neat also clock hasn't changed uh, don't think a calculator changed and in settings you have, they have added a bit more options in the app store you see right there before they never used to have this option app store uh, store you just go into this you can view your account information which um, you can wait for you sh it'll show all the apps you've downloaded uh, which is really neat say you want your history of that they've changed that you can also ability to log in and log out they've changed some of the icons as you see I'll zoom in into the iPod they have lines now, lines of streaks. You probably can't see that yet, guys. But you can see some lines. Same with the messages. They changed that messages app a lot. Next, I want to go into one of my favorite features, Spotlight Search. If you're wondering how I did that. You see, I'm not on the first page. This is actually the second. If you hit that, you can go into Spotlight Search. Or you just hit the Home button. You go into Spotlight Search. Spotlight Search is, if you have a Mac, you should know of it. You just search anything on your phone. I will search Maps. 
just the application, you can just launch it up right there. Or say you looking through text messages, um, your friend texts you, say his name's Joe, type in Joe, emails from him, text messages from him, and contacts will show from Joe. Also in the mail app, which I haven't set up yet, you have ability to search through your emails and view in landscape mode, which is awesome. I've been waiting for landscape mode for pretty much all the um, multimedia apps. Okay, now I'll go into the cut, copy, and paste. So this is the cut, copy, and paste. I'm in Safari. I've selected the Apple's web page, the iPhone's OS. All right, so now I'll just show you how to copy and paste. So I'll go iPhone OS 3.0 software update. I'll just select that. All you have to do is hold up, hold your thumb there. I selected the image. My bad. Hold your thumb there until the magnifying glass comes up, pops up, and then you can let go. Then you get this little rectangle box with two pointers. You can select as much as you want right there, and the copy comes up like that. You can hit it. Once it disappears, it means it's fully copied. Now I'll just go into notes. You can paste this in your mail anywhere. And as you see, it automatically pops up. Or if you don't have that, double tap, paste. And there you go, guys. Right there, cut, copy, and paste. Also, if you select it, you can select all other. You can cut and then return, paste. Paste and then you you can do it multiple times. You can select the whole thing and then paste it on another one. So that's cut, copy, and paste on the iPhone. Next, next we have the ability to tether internet tethering. So basically, if you're in the car um, and you don't have Wi-Fi, you can use your iPhone 3G. Um, cellular network to use it as a Wi-Fi connection for your laptop which is really nice next you have um, I showed you the automatic the YouTube login also the support new languages and I didn't talk about this shake the shuffle now guys once you're in your music app right here I don't have any songs say you're listening to a song um, you want to shuffle it Usually you'd have to go to the button and sh press shuffle. Now you can just shake your device and it will shuffle to a new song. And also you have ability to sync your notes to your PC. Safari improvements. They've improved that I guess by putting in landscape mode. Now it's faster. Way faster in Safari. So yeah guys. This is the 3.0 update on my iPhone. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace.